Congrats on getting the LG NanoCell Smart TV. Now, if you're setting it up for the first time, then let me guide you through the setup process and get your LG WebOS TV ready for action. After taking your TV out of the box, you'll also get a power cable and the LG Magic Remote. After you have positioned your TV, we'll grab the power cable and insert it on the power port that's on the left side of the TV. After that, you can attach your antenna cable or the TV box if you have one. And you can also connect an Ethernet cable if you're going for the wired connection. And after that, we can turn on our TV using the remote. Just make sure it has batteries in it. And after we have turned on our TV, you'll get the screen where you need to press the OK button on your remote. So we'll press on the wheel and then we need to choose the installation method. You can either use the mobile app or you can do it straight from your TV. So let's do it from our TV. Press the OK button again. Select your language, country and time zone. Then we'll select next. Then we need to connect to the internet. Then the terms and conditions will load. We need to press next on that. Then you need to give it some permissions. The first two are mandatory. And the third and fourth one are used for voice commands. So we'll select those and then hit agree. Now in this page, if you have connected any devices using the HDMI cable, they will pop up here. If they don't show up here, then don't worry cause you can set them up later. So we'll select next. Now choose the way how you are gonna watch TV. If you have a set top box or TV box, select this one. If you have antenna, select this one. And if you have both, select this one. We don't have any setup yet, so we'll select none and then hit next. Now we need to enter a postcode to get contents relevant to your location. Select how you have mounted your TV for better audio experience. We'll go with stand and then you'll get prompted to create an LG account or sign in with one. Or you can skip it. But note that without the LG account you won't be able to install any apps. Lastly you can choose apps you can pre-install or you can skip this step too. So we'll press done and just like that our setup is complete. So now you can start watching your favorite content on your LG Smart TV. Happy viewing!